Hello kids. Today we have Toy Boat by Randall D. Save and Loren Long. Let's take a look at it. Toy Boat. This should be good. A little boy had a toy boat. He made it from a can, a cork, a yellow pencil, and some white cloth. The boy loved the boat, and they were never apart. They bathed together, they slept together. And every day, they would go down to the lake and sail all afternoon. The boy held the boat by a string and never let go. Most of the time, this was nice for the boat. But sometimes the little toy boat would look out at big boats gliding across the lake and wonder what it would be like to sail free. One blurry afternoon, a dark cloud rolled all over the lake. The boy's mom pulled him back toward the house. Her tug made him drop the boat's string. The boy cried out as the little toy boat floated away. Boat, he called, boat! But nothing could be done. Wind and rain pushed the little toy boat into deep water. There it bobbed on high waves topped with foam. In time, a black and green tugboat with a row of old tires on its side chugged past. Its windows looked like tired eyes that seemed to say, move along, as it pushed the little toy boat aside with its weight. The little toy boat worked so hard to stay afloat. It almost didn't see the giant ferry in its path. The ferry had two flags and a red smokestack and a horn that bellowed, move along. A gust of wind blew the little toy boat out of the way just in time. A speedboat raced by, flat and sharp with flames on its side. 
Its motor screamed, move along. Its draft made the little boat's sail quiver. Feeling small and scared, Feeling small and scared, the little toy boat drifted out toward a fleet of sailboats racing home to get out of the rain. The little toy boat neared a large sloop. Its hull was white and its sails were trimmed in blue. For a moment, the two boats cut through the choppy waves side by side. And the little toy boat felt big, spraying the little toy boat with water. Then the white boat tilted it high on its side, spraying the little toy boat with water. Warning, move along. Its hull near full, its sail soaked, the little toy boat looked like it would sink. How it missed the boy. Under the yellow moon, the, ye the little toy boat drifted all night, alone and scared. But then, early in the morning, put put, put put. It was a humble little fishing boat, way out in the middle of the lake. Its paint was peeling, and the dents on its side said it knew how it felt to be pushed around on the lake. The fishing boat spied the little toy boat and carefully began to circle it. As it did, something wonderful happened. The little toy boat began to turn as well, and its sail caught a breeze. Soon it was sailing, really sailing alongside the fishing boat. And the little toy boat felt strong. I am moving along, it shouted to the wind. It felt so good that it didn't notice when the fishing boat motored on. It didn't notice the stone beach or the yellow bench on the nearby shore. And it didn't notice the boy, not until he called out, Boat! Boat!
The little toy boat waved its sail excitedly. The boy waved back. That night, they bathed together, they slept together, and the next day they went down to the lake together. The boy held the boat by a string and every so often let go. But the little boy, but the little toy boat always came back. It knew just where it wanted to be. little toy boat. Toy Boat by Randall D. Sev and Loren Lung. Loren Lung. Thanks, kids. Take care. See you next time.